We all use it, but how often do we consider the consequences? I'm talking about In other words, it's highly, highly addictive. You have an entire generation that has access to an addictive, numbing chemical called dopamine through social media and cell phones as they're going through the high stress. They don't have the coping mechanisms to deal with stress. It's, it's much more constant in our lives than, than um, anything else has been. For some people, um, it might be a lot of time is bad. For some people, a lot of time is good. So it really depends on, on the person, but also it depends on what you're looking at. I think this is very important when it comes to social media. A lot of people want to demonize it and say that it's bad for us. But ultimately, we're in control of, of what we view. Now, I think this is so important that if you can create your feed to look up to other people, uh, then, then it's, it gives you something to aspire to. A kind of counterbalance to this is the fact that I found myself comparing my work to other other creatives. Got me into a really weird place. And I think that's what social media does for you, is, is makes you compare to other people. Before we, we would compare to TV and, and, and out there lifestyles, but, but now it's become a kind of more level playing field. So we're comparing ourselves to people that aren't too high above what we could achieve. And, and to me, it creates a bit of <laughs> friction, but then, I had the kind of the self-awareness to, to understand that I was doing that and that that was a bad trait to have because it was getting me into a weird place where I wasn't posted on social media because I thought my work wasn't as good as this person up here. Yeah, just understand that and understand that when it comes to social media, it's such a good tool. But it, it takes that self-awareness to understand when it's becoming a bad tool and when, when you're kind of using it as a form of escapism or you're using it to feel like you're doing work when you're, you're not actually achieving anything. Um, use social media to its benefit. It's that meets so many crazy people, so many creative people, so many different people and, and, and people that you wouldn't normally meet in, in, in kind of everyday life. Um, use it to your benefit. Try not to demonize it because let's face it, it's not going away. So you can either hate it now or, or learn to live with it. Yeah, what was your thoughts on social media? Please let me know in the comments. And I hope you like this kind of video because it's a little bit different to what I normally do.